So here's the drone. We're all set with that. A little something something right there. Drag this bad boy forward. Oh, you actually thought I was going to show you what was in that box? No, that's not what this video is about. What I am going to share with you though, is the trip, the walk, the hike, the poison ivy, <laughs> what it takes to actually get to the spot. Yeah, that's the part that I'm sharing with you. So enjoy. Why don't you? Just do it. Subscribe. Hit that button. Yeah, now it's your turn. Why don't you enjoy it? Watch the video. Throw a thumbs up. Share the page. Like. Subscribe. So that I know that it was worth it. Because I had to. So why don't you? So I think based upon what I'm seeing here, um, yeah, it's not going to matter that I brought the wrong remote for the tornado. can't believe I did that. Well, that's what happens when you can't remember which remote is for which. But it looks like we got some nice area here for the UDR. Definitely some awesome terrain. Nice sandy area all along there. Oh yeah, there's some good stuff here. I'm liking it. All right, now for the um, half a mile walk back. Then we'll get the drone and the UDR. See, I'm already seeing it. Looks like a UDR jump right there. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> oh yeah, this is gonna be mint. What are those words that I like to use? Mint? Look at all that terrain right there. Oh, I still wish that I had the um, tornado though. I tried so hard to like bind it to the other radio, but Apparently the other radio, there is no bind for it, so it put me in a bind of not having the right radio. Man, you know what's funny is when I grabbed the remote too, I was questioning it, and it's my stupidity that all I had to do was just turn it on and make sure that it actually, you know, turned on. Uh, it is what it is. So this is the path that we used to get there. And even right here, some good stuff. UDR territory right here. Look at all this sand. Oh, this is mint. Yeah, this is gonna be nice. So I'll get the drone out and uh, yeah, get some awesome footage or content. Content for the channel. So this is the uh, pathway back. Man, why is it shaking so bad? To have it on the wrong settings or something. Looks like the camera's like shaking all over the place. Oh, uh, even coming up this path with the UDR might be pretty cool. I'm excited. This is actually going to be pretty cool. So I think they call this uh, all in the name of content. So if you look at look at what I've got, I've got my UDR case or RC car case, whatever you call it. Got my backpack on with every piece of imaginable camera something. Then on top of that, I've got my drone. Yeah, I don't know. All in the name of content. I hope you appreciate what I'm doing here. So here's the path that we're gonna go down. Oh yeah, nice. Houston, we did stick. Hey, it's working out. Nice! A little bit of off-roading. Ah, yeah. So there we go, we're coming through. We're through a little path right here. This path is actually not big enough for the case. The case is going off-road. You come down to this little sandy section here, and then you make your way all the way over there. Ah, it's the life. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right there, making my way. I'm 
mean, look at this. This place is perfect, UDR stuff. I mean, right there, the perfect jump. There she is, laying out. Hey, babe. Take a walk over to the big boxes of goodies here. So in this case, obviously we know right here, we've got the drone right there. And then in there, we've got something that's perfect for this terrain. This is gonna be awesome. Oh, I wish I had more than one battery. But you know what? We're here for more than one day. We'll see if the uh, drone is going to be able to follow that bad boy right there. And who knows? Maybe the little guy? Like, maybe I'll actually take that out first. Why not? I was gonna get her into it. Thing is, she doesn't realize she doesn't have to follow it, but I'm gonna kind of just let her do her thing. Right now, what she's doing, she's learning how to use it, which is actually pretty cool. 